were having our dinner watching this event happen. Um, and we're high up on the other side of the river where we're about 40, 50 feet up above the river on the other side. So we were safe, but it was such a dramatic event. I'd never seen anything close to it in my life. And there was like another tree falling, another tree falling, and you could hear a little bit of a rumble. And then it water came and it was, I would say 500 to a thousand trees came out and, and then all this debris and dirt and rocks and uh, it basically dammed the entire Nahatlatch River, um, which is when I became very concerned. Um, and um, but then the, after about 25 minutes, it, the material stopped coming in the same pace that it was coming. It was slowing down more to its closer to its more normal area of water, which is very minimal water at um, this time of year. And um, and then the river broke through the dam, um, but it, it it did raise the river ten feet uh, upstream from us. It's unsettling for us, and it's becoming very personal because I feel that many other parts of the river valley are vulnerable to these rain events now because of the intensity of the fire that hit here and the steepness of our slopes. Um, I think there's going to be more landslides in this area in the future.